Now it's time to lay down the tread rubber. It is this part of the tire which will have a tread pattern and will be in contact with the road surface. The unfinished tire is then put into the curing mold, which has all the tire markings and the tread pattern. A curing bladder filled with hot pressurized water forces the rubber back into the mold cavities. The hot water and steam around the mold start the curing process. This curing, or vulcanization, chemically bonds the rubber compounds to the steel and fabric cord reinforcement components. During this chemical reaction, the tire goes from a plastic to an elastic state. Some time later, the transformation is complete and the tire emerges from its metal shell. The tire has been given its final features and finished shape. Michelin, a better way forward.